Torrey Pines setting up. Looks like we've got a couple substitutions for St. Augustine. Coming out of the game is number 11, Fernando Guzman. He's replaced by Dylan Manriquez, number 14. Off the free kick. Falcons being aggressive, and here comes Manriquez. Sends it back and clear it out. See what Saints does here. Dickdow has it. Nice lead pass ahead there to Wazlowski. Wazlowski coming in hard, and nice sliding tackle there by the Falcons. Percy tried to save it, and I, he, did, he could not. And Wazlowski is still down. Well, that sliding tackle came out of nowhere. That was Zach Lesh Lesher, number 15. So Wazlowski gets up. And here comes the throw in, good strong throw in. And that play gets broken up nicely. Good goes a kick and they get the whistle. That's Michael Patterson. You might remember Patterson if you were watching the games last year on SoCal Sports Productions. Patterson was a JV call up in the, uh, in the later stage of last season and that was his primary role was throwing the ball in because he threw it beautifully into the middle of the pitch on these type of setups and he's continuing to do it here but he's starting now as a on the varsity level this season the talented sophomore so Falcons after all the talk kick it out Valley going to go chase it and now has it See what he does with it. And good kick. Header by Saints. Falcons return it. And they're trying to move it ahead. Advance it. Cannot. Saints get the play. Here they come on the near side. Hershey breaks it up nicely. Tries to move it ahead and kicks it right into the Saints bench. They'll get a quick throw in. Brand Rupp right there. Has it. Nice spin move there by, by Tory Pines. As the ball goes on the outside. A nice spin move was by number nine, senior Jose Salgado. Tory Pines now will throw it in. up on 13 minutes to go here before halftime. And off the, the throw in, Falcons, ooh, boy, that ball hit right off somebody's face. It was a misplay. <laughs> I can't get the number on that Saints player that got it. But man, he took it right off the face and now he just went down to a knee. Wow. Training staff goes immediately out there to see what's going on. As you know, in soccer, the clock t still ticks, even though there's an injury on the, f on the pitch, and they'll go play it at the end for extra time. St. Augustine now getting a couple of players warming up. Looks like we're going to get a substitution here. The junior Josh Carlos, number three, is warming up and looks like he'll come in. Still can't see that number. It's number 23, Michael Patterson. We talked about him and boy, he took it right off the face. Yikes. He's walking under, looks like under his own power, so that's a good thing. Maybe it looked worse than it actually was. 
mostly for his sake. We'll see. He's going to take a seat on the bench, but nevertheless, we'll continue action here. Tory Pines trying to put up a fight like whose possession is it, but I think he hit off a guy's face, I think. And they just gave it up after the free kick. I guess that's the honor thing to do here in soccer. Off the throw in. And Gustin trying to advance it, headed by Tory Pines. Tory, Tory Pines balling up St. Augustine on the far side, but it'll be a throw in for the Saints. Trying to get a lead pass, broken up there by the Falcons. Ball comes in, shot attempt. Oh, nicely played there by Bellow as he tipped it over the net. That was a nice shot there. I think Jacob Fuson took that shot attempt. Now we'll get a corner here. Off it, low kick. Slides through everybody. Falcons trying to clear it out. Kept in by the Saints. They head it. Let's see if they can get the advantage. Torrey Pines. And broken up nicely. St. Augustine looks like they're going to try to throw it in. Both teams trading possession. Trying to get it ahead. Deep pass broken up. Here comes Torrey Pines, another lead pass, kick on net. Wow, how did Valley put his hand on that? That had some velocity coming off that foot. Now Torrey Pines with the substitution. Saints trying to clear it, cannot. Falcons putting the pressure on. Here they come. Lead pass, kick, goal. Nicely executed off the turnover. Just like that, Torrey Pines up 2 nothing. We'll give that goal to number 17, Jacob Levy, for Torrey Pines, and it's 2-0 now. Falcons over St. Saints off the free kick. It's a good one, cross it, can't get it. Chasing it down the Saints. Can they keep it in? Nope. Yes, they can. Ball went off of the Falcons player, so it'll be a throw in for St. Augustine. Under seven here, they gotta get something going here. Down two nothing. Clock here at the stadium says one nothing, but I think that's true. Well, and off the kick attempt goes behind the net. A 
I don't know where they keep the score here. But if you happen to be listening to us here inside Torrey Pines High School, it is 2-0 two, two no Torrey Pines ahead. And the ball goes by a would-be Falcon player and out of play. And that was intended for Cassianos. A.J. Cassianos, the junior, number 20. Saints have it. Tamer. Far side, the Vetter. Can make a play. Now in the center of the pitch. Antonidas. Trying to get it ahead. Castellanos. Loses it momentarily. Zeppelin has it. Zelkin. Back for Castellanos. Over to Antonidas. Shot attempt. And it is a goal. Nice job there. Three nothing, Tory Pines. They have a thirty seven on the roster, but I don't I don't I don't have them on mine. try to get his name for you, but he scored the goal in him, nevertheless. And it's 3 nothing, Torrey Pines. Saints trying to move it. Broken up there. And the ball goes out of play. The free kick here come the Falcons again. Broken up there by Saints. Off the throw in. Falcons and they lose possession. Saints will throw it in. Back with the action. Ball goes out of play and right behind the Saints bench area. We'll try to get the uh, player's n name. He's number 37. And off the, the free kick, Saints now have it. Falcons. Regain possession, trying to clear it out. And they do. Saints going to try to track it down. They send it back to Valley, who kicks it ahead. Header by Hershey. And we get a flag. the free kick Falcons kick it ahead Saints have it they're trying to get some offense going here broken up there nicely by the Falcons but they've been just stifling that that Saints offense right about the midfield mark can't get anything really close and they come again on the far side the 
Pick up another attempt. There goes a shot and just wide. Probably went after the ball, and I don't know if he kind of blinded the, the kicker for a second on where the crease was, but nevertheless, it went just wide. Off the throw in. Saints kicking it ahead here on the near side. Wazowski trying to advance it and loses it. So Saints will throw it in. With two minutes to go, but there, God believe there's some extra time here. And off the throw in. Broken up there by Tan Augustine. Falcons off the throw in. It is Elijah Zelkin, number three. Tries to throw it in, broken up there. Saints are trying to advance it. Pal Palalock kicks it ahead and a little bit too far ahead. David Rezalowski and the, and the Falcons now will have it. You can hear the St. Augustine's coaching staff pleading for some energy from this team as they get a couple of substitutions into the match. Coming on to the pitch is Evan Williams, uh, number 18, a sophomore. Number 13, Jack Kelm returns. And off the free kick by Bellow, the keeper. Saints trying to get something going here. Broken up there nicely. By the Falcons. Hershey. Trying to advance it. Saints keeping it in. Kelm, nice feed here to Dicktow on the far side. Let's see if they can get something here. Saints keeping it in. Nice play there by Valdez. Both teams going for it. Trying to head it ahead. Torrey Pines following him up. There goes the shot attempt. Broken up there by the Falcon. And that ball goes all the way back towards the keeper for St. Augustine who kicks it here on the near side. Nicely broken up there by the Falcons. Comes a good opportunity. They have the numbers, Story Pines. Saints play it nicely and get it out of there and get it out of the way. And the kick out by the keeper. And that goes out of play. We'll get a throw in here by St. Augustine. Off the throw in. Falcons have it. Saints trying to get it ahead. Cannot. Trying to get a lead pass. Again broken up by St. Augustine. Tie up. Both teams going for it. Falcons clear it out. St. Augustine trying to keep it on the offensive side of the pitch. And that's broken up there by Torrey Pines. the throw in. Torrey Pines trying to get it ahead and that will go out of play. That pass attempt. Another throw in. And Falcons player gets pushes off the Saints no call and then gets it advances it ahead. Falcon player falls down trying to gain control. Here they come in. Nice lead pass. Shot attempt goes high over the crease and out of play. Let's see what they do. Still here an extra time. Passing good news for him coming back into the contest. He replaces Dean Dickdow. The free kick. Both teams trying to get something going. Falcons here on the near side. 
Cassianos trying to get around a defender. Shot attempt broken up nicely there by Valley. Read it perfectly. Free kick. Hershey heads it. Falcon. Hershey. That's a header attempt and it goes over to the St. Augustine bench. Well, let's see, we'll get a throw in here. And Enriquez throws it in. Broken up there by the Falcons. Trying to clear it out. And that will do it for the first half. So three goals for Torrey Pines. And they lead it here 3-0 as we head to half. We'll take a quick timeout and then be back with more action here on the SoCal Sports presentations of St. Augustine Soccer. We'll be right back. The innocence of youth. Is there anything any better? But soon they'll be in high school and facing all the same challenges you faced. How to make friends. How to fit in. How to be cool. We want our children to have everything they'll need to live fulfilling and productive lives. Make sure the kids in your family are among the more than 12 million participants in America who take part in high school sports or activities. High school sports fans, relive your favorite moments. Just click the shopping cart below the video player and select DVD or digital copy to get yours today. High school sports fans, relive your favorite moments. Just click the shopping cart below the video player and select DVD or digital copy to get yours today.
great? Participate. Where does greatness start? Here, in the classroom. On the stage. In the pool. On the field. Where will your greatness take you? To better grades. To more friends. Yeah! Be great. Participate! <laughs>High school sports fans, relive your favorite moments. Just click the shopping cart below the video player and select DVD or digital copy to get yours today. He's going to take it himself for a championship! Wow. The NFHS Learning Center is the leader in online education for the interscholastic community. At NFHSLearn.com, you can find over 70 courses, including more than 30 free courses, such as concussion in sports, heat illness prevention, sudden cardiac arrest, and protecting students from abuse. To learn more, visit the NFHS Learning Center. In the pool. On the field. Where will your greatness take you? To better grades. To more friends. Yeah! Be great. Participate! <laughs> The innocence of youth. Is there anything any better? But soon they'll be in high school and facing all the same challenges you faced. How to make friends. How to fit in. How to be cool. We want our children to have everything they'll need to live fulfilling and productive lives. Make sure the kids in your family are among the more than 12 million participants in America who take part in high school sports or activities.
into the end zone. What a catch! The Kyle's on touchdown. Into the layup goes at the buzzer. Elijah wins it. The championship. Back here for second half action here on SoCal Sports Production. Jane Augustine Soccer here brought to you live tonight as the Torrey Pine Falcons lead St. Augustine three to nothing on Thomas Conroy. And we'll give you a quick recap on the scoring. It's been all Torrey Pines. They are their goal scorers for the contest is number twenty-three Alvar Brandrup with one. And we finally got the number. For number 37 on Torrey Pines, it's Matteo Pacelli. And Pacelli, by the way, scored two goals in that period. So I, I incorrectly stated that Jacob Levy scored one of the three goals for Torrey Pines. But it was two for Pacelli. And for Pacelli, he is now on the pitch starting here in the second half. So score a couple of goals and kind of stay on the pitch longer than maybe you were anticipating. Chance got to do something here to get their offense going. They've been throttled here by the Falcons. And not surprising, Falcons coming in the contest tonight, 7-1-2. and two, Ranked 31st, 31st nationally, 11th in the state of California. So they're a good soccer team. And they're proving it here tonight. St. Augustine has not had their typical scoring chances as they've had in this part of the season. St. Augustine comes in the contest tonight, 3-3-3. Three, three, and three. As we get going, Hershey kicks it off of a Saints player, and we'll get a quick throw in by Elijah Zelkine. Trying to lead it ahead. Both teams fighting for the ball. And here comes the kick here on the near side. Shot ahead, broken up there by the Falcons. Still doing the same type of play as we saw in the first half. St. Augustine getting a little bit more aggressive. And on that play, they s looked like St. Augustine thought they were going to throw it in, but they give it to Torrey Pines. Off the throw in, Gomez throws it in. Saints trying to get it ahead. Broken up there nicely and goes off of Tucson leg. And back to Torrey Pines. Torrey off the throw in. And then near side. Trying to get it ahead. St. Augustine has it. Trying to get to the middle of the pitch. And it's broken up there nicely. Falcons now on the far side. Little give and go, trying to lead pass it ahead and broken up there by the Saints. Trying to get some scoring opportunities as they trail by three. St. Augustine. Lead pass broken up by Hershey. Falcons. Little give and go between two teammates. St. Augustine though does look a little bit more aggressive than they than they than they were in the first half. Let's see if that comes out and produces some scoring opportunities. They've had possession, but they cannot get towards the net. And that pass gets out towards the crease. Bellow comes out, but we had a whistle before it. And it looks like Torrey Pines will get a free kick. Hershey off the free kick, San Augustine trying to move it ahead. And that ball goes away. Saints trying to throw it in. 
Trying to get in the middle, nicely broken up. Saints here on the near side. Kick him in the middle of the pitch. That's Motale, David Motale, number two, the senior. Percy playing give and go with a teammate. Knocked down there by Saints, but we get the whistle as they gain control of the ball. Kick here by Reed Hershey, Junior. And Saints track it down. A little bit more action now in uh, the Falcons offensive zone and the Saints kick it out of play to kind of regroup. Off the throw in. Saints break it up. Tory Pines trying to get it in the middle. And can't get anything to go. Yep, it goes off of the actually the Falcons player. Let's see if Kenny Gusson can get something out of here. Off the throw in. Here it comes as uh Gets played right in front of Torrey Pines' bench area. And St. Augustine advances it and throws it in on the far side. Coming over, trying to get beat two defenders. Wide angle shot. Or I should say a tight angle shot. Comes all the way across. Saints thought they had it. And Falcons kick it off of number nine, Jacob Fuson's leg. So they regain possession. Off the throw in. <laughs> Kelly. He's got a target right on St. Augustine's player's face. And they keep it in. Fusan trying to get around. Pacelli cannot. And that will be picked up there by number 15, Zach Lesher. And he kicks it right back to the kicker, Nick Bellow. Less hurt, trying to get it ahead. Played there by the Saints. Kick in the middle of the pitch. Hit ahead by Gomez. Now on the far side, here come the Falcons on the move. Followed up there nicely by the Saints, but here come the Falcons, they get an opening. Nicely pass ahead, Saints partially block it, but here comes a shot attempt. And it goes right through. And Valley chases it down to pick it up and he gets a quick throw throw out. Kick goes towards the middle of the pitch. Played there by Zelkin. And Saints here on the near side. Fusan, middle of the pitch. Nice lead pass back to Fusan, a little bit ahead of him, broken up there nicely by Zelkin. Shelly on the far side, trying to get it out ahead. Nicely played there by the Saints. Now move it towards the near side here, see if they can get something going. Lead pass off of Gomez's foot. And sent back out by a Falcon teammate. Got an injured Falcon player, I think that's Matteo Pacelli. But he might have knocked knees with the Saints player. Getting up though, running back into the action. Give and go, lead pass broken up there by the Saints. Here comes St. Augustine now, trying to get it ahead. And 
and broken up nicely there by Tory Pines. Hudson Gomez now with the throw in, number 47 for Tory Pines. Late addition to their varsity roster. One of their top players, Owen Underwood, a senior, broke his foot and he is out six weeks, but talking to him on the, on the pitch during pregame, he, he's, hope, he's hopeful that he can come back for the, uh, for the playoff run with the Falcons. Reed Hershey trying to kill some time off the clock. We're at the 30, coming up, if I should say, approaching the 30 minute mark. Left in this contest, nice lead ahead. Tory Pines, ball gets loose. Hershey moving it ahead. And that's out of play. Falcons moving ahead. Pacelli. Nice lead pass. Can't get anything on it. Middle, Pacelli, shot blocked by the Saints player. Backwards kick, nicely played there by Valley. Good action there by both sides. Valley made an excellent save. Falcons putting on the pressure. Ty Barton trying to send it in the middle. Trying to set up a player broken up there nicely by Brian Powell, Powell Loke. And here come the Saints. Middle of the pitch, here comes Fusan. Looking for a teammate. Gets one on the far side. Pass a little bit behind him. Trying to lead it ahead. Broken up there nicely there by the Falcons. And that was Louis Molino. He sent it ahead. One on one there. Black. Couldn't get anything on it. And that lead pass goes all the way back to Nick Valley, the keeper for St. Augustine. Play now a little bit more wide open than the first half. As Saints trying to grab it, uh, but Hershey once again makes a nice play. A little bit too far of a lead pass there. To a teammate, and that goes out of play. Aiden Johnson comes off the pitch for St. Augustine. And off the throw in, header ahead. Trying to get the give and go and it goes out of play. Fusan trying to make something of it, could not. And Gomez chased the ball down, so he gets uh, to the opportunity to throw it back into play. Saints trying to advance it ahead. Fusan heads it to the middle of the pitch. Falcons trying to gain control. Nice give and go. Good lead pass and just a little bit too far ahead as the ball will go out of play. Looks like we'll get a throw in. Troy Pines. And ready to throw it in. High throw in. Saints trying to move it ahead. And can't do anything with it. 
turnover. Reed Hershey, the junior, now will take the free kick. And he puts it high in the air on the, on the, the far side. Saints trying to kick it out of the zone. They do. Broken up there by the Falcons. Saints now have it. Good fake coming in the middle of the pitch. That's Rizlowski. He sends it back out on the far side. And shot attempt by the Saints. Too far of an angle. I don't know if that hit a Falcon player. It looked like it did. So it will be a corner kick for St. Augustine. Thought for a minute Fusan would take the corner kick, but they're going to give it to. I believe that's Diego Fembrez. And there goes the header attempt. Nicely saved there by Bello. Nicely set up, and Patterson with the header couldn't put it in. Ooh. Sliding tackle, and boy, that Tory Pines player hit hard on the turf. Dean Dickdow with the sliding tackle, but Tory Pines player tried to jump over him and then fell hard on his shoulder. Might have knocked the wind, might have knocked more of the wind out of himself than anything. That's Zach Lesser. Lesser now up on his feet. Still bent over. He looks okay, though. He'll continue to play. Hudson Gomez now will take the free kick. And that's a high kick. This opportunity, I don't know who that went out of. Official says, uh, finally, after, I don't know who he's conferring with. I think he's conferring actually with the judge, the judge right in front of the St. Augustine bench area that has, uh, like, crawls the offside, and he said it went off of Troy Pines. Nevertheless, Saints have possession. The lead pass goes too far, and we get a whistle. That's an offside on St. Augustine. Twenty-four oh eight to go here. Don't think there's any extra time in this second half thus far. Off the free kick, broken up there by St. Augustine. So it'll be a throw in by Tory Pines. Throw in. Saint Augustine aggressive, trying to get possession. Ball goes beyond Hershey. Who's on charging in? He'll put it back towards Bello. He just clears it out. Gomez trying to lead it ahead. Broken up there by the Saints. Husan right here on the near side coming in towards the middle of the pitch. Nope, nice lead pass ahead. Picked up there by Carlos. Carlos can't do anything with it. Husan trying to get through two defenders. Broken up partially. Metalli trying to get around somebody. Can't get a good shot off. And that ball just rolls right to Nick Bello. That was the best opportunity for the Saints in this contest. Good penetration there. Let's see if they can continue that. Hershey on the far side for Tory Pines. Leads it ahead. Play broken up at midfield. 
Now beautiful lead pass for Bocelli. Saints have it. Ooh, Valley ran into his defender and tried to clear it out by kicking it. And then Falcons just put a shot on net and that went wide but almost went. That could have been disastrous because if that was on target, that would have went in. Substitutions now for Saints coming in the contest. Evan Williams again. Off the free kick. Falcons trying to grab it. Fusan does for St. Augustine. Lead ahead too far for Carlos, the junior. Torrey Pines, they roll it out to Hershey. Trying to get a nice lead pass, broken up beautifully there by Saints. They bring it into the middle. Metalli. Good long kick on the far side. Both teams trying to track it down, and Falcons have it momentarily. And now Torrey Pines has possession. A beautiful lead pass here. And oh, the defender for St. Augustine just took him down. In any sport, football, that's holding, and in soccer, and that's an infraction. That might be a card. Yep, yellow card. Well, he saved a good, an opportunity of a one-on-one -on -one situation for his goalie, but number 15, Isaac Tamer, has to come off the field because of the yellow card. Coming in his place is Michael Patterson, the sophomore. Good to see him back in the contest. And he took that shot off the face there on the far side of the field in the first half. Torrey Pines having a discussion, two players. One of them is Ty Barton, with the official. I don't know what they're discussing. I guess where the position of the, f of the free shot attempt is. Uh, nevertheless, they were overruled by the official, so we'll get the shot opportunity right now. Barton going to set himself up. Just inside the circle. And Augustine. Shot attempt going high. Broken up there by Saints. And Fusan loses it. Try to kick it ahead. To Carlos, but Carlos was not ready for it, so we'll get a throw in. Gomez quickly throws it in. Pacelli gets around the defender. Trying to take a shot in on net. See who has it. Saints does. They clear it out. Falcons keeping the pressure on. Lead. Shot attempt in the middle. Header attempt. No good. pitch St. Augustine nicely blocked there by Torrey Pines they keep it give and go attempt and St. just kicks it out Pines now will throw it in. Now we're going to get some substitutions for the Falcons. 
They lead it 3-0 with 17 minutes in the contest. Off the throw in, Saints trying to advance it, kept in by Torrey Pines. Torrey Pines has the lead and the possession of the ball. They put it in the middle of the pitch. They'll have it, Pacelli. Can't get around two defenders, broken up there nicely by St. Augustine. As the lead kick is too far, and Bello plays it nicely all the way back towards his crease area. Bello gonna play it smart here. Sends it off to Zach Lesser. Ball broken up, Lesser kicks it on the far side. And nice lead now for the Falcons. They have the numbers if they can execute it. Coming in on net, nice, nice sliding tackle there by Patterson. And that ball goes out of play. throw in and goes out of play and Saints have it off the throw in Hershey Torrey Pines kicks it ahead Saints have it they lose it here come the Falcons on the far side. Another slide and tackle. Nice play by St. Augustine. The ball comes to Pacelli. Sends it back out to Barton. Pacelli to Gomez. Lead ahead here. Shot goes in the middle, and that's broken up. Falcons look like they're playing keep away from Saints right now. Trying to kill some time with the three goal lead. And that ball goes out of play back to St. Augustine. No, nope, maybe not because it looks like they're setting up for a corner kick here. And they are. Torrey Pines will take it to the far corner. Shot attempt. Broken up nicely by the Saints defender. Valley didn't see where the ball was. Carlos gets run off the ball by Torrey Pines. And that one goes out of play off of a teammate. Saints trying to throw it in. Helm can't get it. The give and go and by Patterson and Fusan doesn't work. Falcons will throw it in. And off the throw in, Saints have it. Good throw in here. Broken up by Torrey Pines. Back out to midfield. St. Augustine trying to do something here offensively, cannot. And we'll get the throw in. Looks like Falcons will do it. Lead pass went too far. And Valley runs off Pacelli. Now we get a whistle. Substitution time. Julian Valdez comes in. And number four, Tom Zetter comes in, the senior. For St. Augustine. Off 
off the free kick. Saints trying to get something offensively, see what they can do. Helm sends it back to the middle of the pitch. Falcons bottle up Saints once again. Trying to reset the offense, broken up there by the Falcons. Lead pass played nicely there by number 14, Manriquez for St. Augustine. A couple players collide. Falcons come up with the possession. Lead pass broken up by St. Augustine. Trying to advance it, cannot. Coming up on the 11 minute mark here in the second half. Three nothing Torrey Pines over St. Augustine. All three goals came in the first half. One by number 23, Junior Alvar Brandrup, and two by Matteo Michelli, number 37, for Torrey Pines. <laughs> Waiting for a throw in now. Saints throw it in. And played by the Falcons. Saints have had trouble getting anything going offensively. They started out aggressively here in the second half, but it only really helped them only get one good solid scoring opportunity in the contest, second half wise. Falcons have showed us why they're ranked so high in both state and in nationally. And here comes Saints. Kicking it out ahead, Gomez misplays it. He, he gathers himself and gains control and here come the Falcons. Nice lead pass, Valley comes out and plays it nicely. Here comes Saints trying to get something going, something on the board. Collision at midfield and we'll get a whistle. The free kick. Good high kick. Broken up there by the Falcons. Saints trying to get something. And that ball will go out of play. Trying to get a throw in now. We're under 10 minutes to go in the contest. Clock moves fast once you get under 10. Header attempt, played nicely by Bello. Trying to preserve his shutout. Falcons send it ahead. They're just trying to kill the clock and keep it out of their zone. There goes the shot attempt. Valley was gonna play it and luckily he didn't because he went back and deflected off him nicely on the shot attempt by Black. Looks like we'll get a corner kick. Couple of substitutions. Now we'll finally get the corner kick. Elijah Zelkin now will take it. Taking his time over under eight minutes ago. Kick. Header. Broken up by Valley again. Shot on Valley and that time. Did the ball go in? Yep. Ball goes in, Valley throws the ball out in the midfield. He made two excellent scoring stops, but could not get the third one as it bounced off of him and into the crease. Had to wait for the official to put his hands up and motion that it was a goal. Give the goal to number 22, Reed Hershey. And that will make it four nothing now, Torrey Pines. Thank you. 
Saints trying to get it ahead. 4-0, as we said, Falcons over St. Augustine. Clear out attempt. Both teams trying to contest the ball. Trying to get it ahead. Lead pass a little bit too far for Torrey Pines. Ooh, a nice sliding tackle. Boy, that is like the fourth sliding tackle by Tamer in the contest. Now he falls to the ground. I don't know if his uh, leg jammed or his he's having a hard time putting any pressure on his right leg. Now I'm looking at maybe it was his left leg that he hurt. He's running behind the net. I think he's coming out of the game because Fusan just ran onto the pitch. Off the throw in. Ball goes out of play. Saints have it, they'll throw it in, broken up there by the Falcons. And we get a whistle. Offside, Torrey Pines. Nope. Infraction on St. Augustine. Didn't see that. Saints trying to get something going here. Falcons still contesting the ball. Nicely played there. They took it away. Saints now have it. Trying to get the lead pass. A little bit too out in front. Gomez knocks down a Saints player. And he'll make the lead pass. Knocked down by San Augustine. Both teams trade possession. Here they come out on the far side. Lead pass, broken up by Saints. Zali kicks it out to midfield. Under four to go in the contest. Falcons looking like they're playing keep away. And a shot attempt, nice play there by Zali. He throws it out here on the near side. Saints, middle of the pitch, can't get it too far ahead. Falcons coming in. Saints throws the player off, no whistle, and they get possession. So getting a little bit chippy here at the end of the contest. St. Augustine moving it along. Lead pass. Is it kept in? Yep, kept in by Saints. Shot attempt broken up there by the Falcons. Now one to three to go. We're going to get a corner kick? Nope. They got to throw it in. Official motion in. Now, the th now it's actually Torrey Pines, which I thought it was. Now they have possession. 
Don't know what happened there, but nevertheless, Falcons have it. And Reed Hershey has it, and he lines up a beautiful kick out to midfield. Saints trying to advance it, cannot. And the pass comes here on the near side. Saints trying to get the uh, donut off the scoreboard, and they have two minutes to do it. Falcons playing keep away. Coming in the offensive zone. Nice lead to Jacobson. Barton loses it. And it'll be a throw in by Gomez of Torrey Pines. Off the throw in. Saints trying to get it ahead. Hershey can't get it. And now he, his pass goes off of a teammate and Saints will throw it in. Off the throw in. Saints can't get anything. Hershey tries to clear it, but it goes out of play. Saints now will throw it in. Throw it in the middle. Broken up there by the keeper. And Hershey again. Knocks off a Saints player and then they kick it out to midfield. Looks like a free kick opportunity now for Saints. Falcons building their wall. They can't move on the shot attempt. And it's a high one. It goes over the crease. And out of play. Bello. He's going to kick it here on the near side. To the lesser. Tries to get it out ahead. Knocked down by the Saints. And then your side, oop, turnover. Jacobson. Now Falcons get it on the far side. See what they can do. Cassianos in the game. And he loses it. Saints are trying to advance it. Falcons keep it in. And there goes a the clear out, but Hershey has it for Torrey Pines. Another kick ahead. And out of play, it looks like it'll be a throw in for St. Augustine. <laughs> Off the throw in. Saints. He's trying to do anything. As the time is now with the official on the field. And there goes a bad lead pass. Falcons have it. Trying to get around defender, cannot. That was a good tackle there. Jacobson fell to the turf. Saints trying to advance it ahead and kick it out of play. Almost nailed the, uh, the team doctor or trainer right on the, oh no, I guess it was the camera. Thought that was a bag, but it was the camera. Almost got nailed in the head with that kick attempt. Off the throw in. Ball goes back to Bellow. Now he's playing keep away from the Saints. They kick it out again, Torrey Pines. 
Saints trying to get one last scoring opportunity, a scoring chance. There goes a lead kick broken up by Hershey. He's had a terrific game. Shot attempt goes over the crease by Carlos. Referee looking at his watch, so we got to be close to time to the end of this contest. 4-0, Torrey Pines leads it. Bless her, back to Bello. Now the lesser on the near side, back to Bello. Lesser trying to move. And blocked off of Vetter. Throw in off of Jacobson. Now St. Augustine will throw it in. Patterson, good throw in. Reed Hershey plays it and now kicks it off to the side. St. Augustine will let Patterson throw it in. Team will line up near the net. Off the throw in. Header in for the goal. Good throw in by Patterson and he had his teammate there. And that was Evan Williams, the sophomore, number 18 with the goal. So they break the shutout, 4-1. Williams, number 18, a sophomore midfielder, and he gets the goal. And the Falcons put the ball in play, and now we get it officially put in play. And that will do it. So right at the end of the contest, Williams gets a goal. And got to be pretty happy, the sophomore, with the, with the score. So it's both teams now walk off the field. Torrey Pines wins this one, four to one. And they up their record now to eight, one and two this season.